Chapter 162 One with Selfless Self Maharaj You listened to the Master. Then you contemplated on the knowledge which brought understanding. With intense meditation you acquired intellectual conviction. This is all well and good. At the advanced stage, everything has to be absorbed. Intense meditation will lead to spontaneous conviction, a direct experience of truth. Just now, you understand, you know, but at the same time, there is still some guessing going on, maybe just a little. That's okay. Spontaneous conviction will happen. Spontaneous conviction will happen. And then you will say, Yes, I am Brahman, as sure as you are a man or a woman. The holder of this body is called Brahman and has no connection with the world and the body. This is the quality of the conviction. The signs of spirituality are total calm, quiet and peacefulness. These qualities lie internally. They are not for show. You are already with you. But still, you need to give more importance to your hidden power. Keep up the practice of meditation and self-inquiry. It is essential at the start. Even though you know it is only a stairway and not ultimate truth, you still have to go beyond. Keep going deeper and ask the question, Who am I doing this practice for? Questioner. I know what you are saying. There is a danger that you can get lost in the practice and there are loads of practices to choose from. I visited a guru recently and he had a specific practice that we were to follow. I had to follow five rules concerning hair, how to wear it, not to shave, etc. Maharaj, did you have any hair prior to being this? You are unknown to yourself. You do not know yourself. Forget about hair. There was no material, no intellectual knowledge prior to being this. You were unknown to you. These nonsense rules about hair are only connected to the body, mind, ego, intellect. It is all material knowledge. Spontaneous self-knowledge is connected to the bottom of your realisation. The bottom of your realisation without the body. Spontaneously. My words are very specific. Spiritual and intellectual knowledge and mind, ego, intellect are all physical, intellectual knowledge. This kind of knowledge is material knowledge, connected to the subtle part of the body. It was not there prior to beingness. It came along with the body and it will be dissolved with the body. You have therefore given birth to the mind, ego, intellect and all the spiritual knowledge. There is so much talk about the spiritual Every time you pay attention to all the spiritual talk and the sayings of the latest guru on the block, you are ignoring your invisible listener that is ultimate truth. Not only are you underestimating yourself, you are insulting yourself. Get involved with you. When you throw yourself into the ocean of spirituality, you will have fun. You will find it very interesting and, and enjoyable. Don't just stay at the bank of the river, anxiously trying to keep yourself safe and dry. 
swim in the deep sea. There you will find enjoyment. Yes, this is great. You will get to know your power. You are everything. Don't depend on anyone else's mercy. Put your hand on your head. Under the Master's guidance and with meditation, you have learned the technique of spirituality, pragmatic spirituality. Counting the years, torturing the body with different practices, wearing saffron clothes, garlands, decorating the body, etc. Why? Why all this? What will you get from doing it all? Nothing. If you wish to decorate anything, decorate your inner listener with spiritual knowledge, with faith. This is most important. How to be? It is very, very simple. All that is needed is your willingness. Yes, I have to know. This is the full stop. That conviction is supposed to be there. Yes. Yes. This is my final address. This is my home. I am not going anywhere. I am staying put. Be internally strong. Be spiritually strong. Surrender totally. Total surrender. Your view of the world has changed. There has only ever been oneness. Keep going. Closer and closer. Closer and closer to selfless self. This internal change that has taken place signifies that you have no connection to beingness. This is the principle of spirituality which is being absorbed spontaneously. Think on yourself. You have been given the mirror of knowledge. It is your mirror. With continuous practice and absorption, know thyself and be within the selfless self. Know thyself and be within the selfless self.